Hey, for friends, Catman here. Welcome back to my channel. Hey guys, hope you're all doing well out there. Today we have another HelloFresh video. So for today's menu, we have the Southwest chicken sausage and rice skillet. All right, so let's check out all the ingredients. Let's see what's inside the bag. Well, first off, we have the sweet Italian chicken sausage. And of course, the meat always comes packed separate. All right, now let's see what's inside the bag. All right, we have our produce. So we start off with an onion. We have a lime, tomato. Let's see what in here. We have a big green chili. And then some of our other, there's some cheese, some Cholula sauce, uh, some sour cream, a little chicken stock, probably for the rice. And of course, the rice. Whoops. Hey, Jojo. And we have some, ooh, smoky Southwest seasoning. All right, this should be pretty good. Okay, I've washed and dried my produce. Now, first what I want to do is I want to start the rice. So I'm going to get three quarters of a cup of water and my serving of rice. I'm going to put that in a pot and bring that to a boil. So let's head over to the stove and start that. Okay, three quarters of a cup of water. Our pack of rice. That all in there. All right. And then a pinch of salt. A pinch of salt. All right. Now we're going to bring that to a boil and then we're going to simmer that for about 15 minutes. All right. So now while I'm waiting for the rice to heat up, I'm going to prep all my vegetables. So I'm going to start off with I'm going to zest a quarter of the lime and save that for later. And then I'm going to dice up all my other vegetables. Okay, now we're just gonna zest about a quarter of the skin here. We don't need a lot for this. Just a little bit of extra seasoning. Yeah, something about like that. All right, we're gonna save that. To set this aside, let's dice the tomato. And now for the chili. Get rid of that. It seeds out. I'm just going to have to cut this guy in half. Okay, now I'm gonna prepare the cream and topping. So for this, I'm gonna use some sour cream, uh, juice from some of this lime, and a little pinch of salt. So we're gonna start putting this together. Okay, the first of two sour cream tubes. Okay, okay now I'm gonna give this a little pinch of salt. Just a little bit of this lime in there. There you go. I'm not going to juice the whole half. I'm going to just do a little bit and then I'm going to try it, see how it tastes, add a little bit more later if I need it. And okay, now I'm going to make the salsa. So, this I'm going to use the lime zest. I'm going to juice some more lime into this and I'm going to add the diced tomato and a little bit of olive oil, and we're gonna stir that all up. All right, now for the main part is the sausage, and the onions, and the pepper. We're gonna saute this in a pan. So right now I'm trying to heat my pan up, and when it gets good and hot, we're going to start off with the sausage. So 
gonna take a couple minutes. We'll be right back. All right, the pan's nice and hot, so let's put the sausage in. There we go. All right. Okay, it's starting to brown. Just gonna keep stirring and topping and stirring and topping until it's a little piece, or whatever size pieces you like. Okay, and now we've just got this fairly brown, but it's not done cooking, so we want to put all the onion and the peppers in. There we go, cook that all together. The Salto seasoning mix. We'll pour that all over. There we go. Mix that in really good. Okay, so the veggies are all nice and soft, and the chicken's fully cooked. So now it's time to add the rice. So here's my still warm rice. I'm gonna add this in here. All right, set that to the side. Now I'm also gonna add a tablespoon of butter, a quarter cup of water, and the chicken stock. And they're gonna mix this all up until it's all combined. Now next, get all those flavors together. Yeah. Okay, last step is we're gonna to top everything with this Mexican cheese blend, and then we're gonna put it in the broiler until it's bubbly and lightly brown. This is gonna be really good. All right, so come on over here and let's put some cheese on. Nice little even sprinkling all the way around. And there we go. Okay, I'm waiting for my broiler to heat up, and then we're gonna pop that in the oven. All right, now to put it in the broiler. Now make sure your pan's oven safe when you do this, otherwise you're gonna have to transfer it to something that is. Now you're gonna to wanna to watch this because the broiler's gonna melt that cheese pretty quick. So I'm going to close the oven door and we're going to check on this uh, every 30 seconds or so and see how it's going. There it is. That looks really good. Now it's time to top it and serve it up. Okay, now it's time to top it. So first is the tomato salsa. And I'm just going to kind of spread that around all over. Yeah. A little more over there. A little more over here. This is going to be really good. I tried this. It's Nice and zesty, and the lime gives it a good zing. There we go, all that in there. All right. Next is the crema. All right. Let's see if we can get a nice, good drizzle out of this. Oh, yeah, that looks really good. That came out perfect. If you want to make it hot, you can drizzle a little chulo on there. I'm going to save this for last and let the people decide what they want to put on theirs. And voila, it's all done. Check that out, yummy, yummy. You know what? I can't wait. I'm gonna try a little bit. Mmm. Oh my God, this is fantastic. Mm. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. See you next week for friends, bye-bye. You think, Bing? Yeah. Let's eat. This is good. Mm-hmm.